Hey, this is Meg Montgomery, and I'm back for the second episode of my new video blog called The Quantum Approach to Healthy Living. And right now we're talking about diabetes type 1. However, the information in this episode is, from my understanding, applicable to most autoimmune diseases. The medical establishment says that diabetes type 1 cannot be cured and they're very happy to see new patients who they know will be dependent on their care for the rest of their life. But I've been researching holistic medicine for the past several years and I already knew that diabetes type 1 is being cured all over the world. So in the time that we've been home from the hospital I've been doing my research and I've found many many people who have had tremendous success in curing this disease and there's a singular approach and that approach is that our body breaks down when we're too infested with pathogens of many different kinds so uh, for instance there's parasites there's fungus there's viruses there's bacteria there's heavy metals like so many different things that just get deep into our tissues and our organs and prevent our body from functioning correctly. So all of these doctors are using protocols to flush all of this crap out of our bodies. And once we get to a point of homeostasis again, the organs start working again, fully, fantastically, perfectly. And uh, specifically with diabetes type 1, there's ways to regenerate the beta cells that produce the insulin. And so really, um, it's all holistic, it's completely non-invasive. Um, it's just a matter of changing our diet and taking particular things to eradicate those pathogens from our bodies. There is one doctor in particular who kind of represents a lot of the research that I've been doing and he has very lovely success. He's in South Florida. His name is Dr. Lonnie Herman and I found him on YouTube and watched several of his videos. I said this is really a great example of what I've seen in the past and uh, what I know is already happening around the world. Now this is just one approach but uh, I just want to use it as an example for um, for what he found in somebody's tissues. So he um, he cures all kinds of autoimmune diseases, but this information is from a man who um, was really suffering horribly from type 1 diabetes for a long time. And this is just what he found in the man's blood cells, the hemoglobin. Um, and in the red blood cells he found the Lyme Borrelia bacteria, he found monosodium glutamate, MSG, um, residue from horrible antibiotics like Cipro, uh, phthalate chemicals, which we get from our body care products, penicillin, gold from um, dental fillings, which is very, very toxic, nanobacteria, which comes from chemtrails, uh, mercury, which could come from either dental fillings or from vaccines, and he also found toxic mold. Now, when he went into this man's kidney nephron, the tissue of the kidneys, he found much, 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 much worse stuff. Um, but so, so every different place you go, you're going to find different things that are kind of attracted to those, those places in the body. And so then once you know what's there, then you can get a protocol to help you get rid of that stuff. And I know, because I had Lyme, that the Lyme um, bacteria is very difficult to get rid of. It's uh, the spirochete and it just, it knows how to hide, it knows how to camouflage. But I guess some of these doctors have finally figured out how to really seriously eradicate that particular uh, pathogen. Um, now, Dr. Herman also last year had a patient, a little girl about my son's age, um, who went into the hospital in, I think, October of last year, or September of 2015, uh, with blood sugar of way over 700, which is, you know, even worse than my son's. And she was in the hospital for about four or five days, and then her parents flew her right down to see him. And within a month of seeing him, she was off insulin, and her pancreas is working perfectly. Her beta cells had completely regenerated in just one month. So that's how fast the cure can happen. Once you know what it is that's shutting down your body and you get yourself on the, the protocol to cure it. So you there's no life sentence 
of suffering from these diseases if you take responsibility for your own health. If you leave it to your doctors um, who are dependent on the healthcare industry, um, you know, it's, that's kind of like old knowledge, that's old school. As far as I'm concerned, that's the old world. The new world, which is the quantum world, is finding out really what's the fundamental cause of our body not working. So um, that's the new information for this week. I hope that you get some, some new perspective on this uh, to help you understand. I will be providing a list of um, people who can help you to find out what pathogens you have in your body in a very simple way. Uh, and also to uh, doctors who are having very successful treatments for, um, for many different kinds of autoimmune diseases, all different kinds. There's not just one way to cure this stuff, there's many, many different ways. So thanks so much for listening. I'm wishing you all uh, very wonderful holidays and a merry, blessed, happy 2017. Thank you.